I think it's a very serious matter, considering the fact that uh, Pakistan already has very strained relations with other neighbors. And then historically, Pakistan and Iran have all, always enjoyed good relations. They are Muslim countries, they are neighbors. Um, but at this um, time, Iran, when itself is so isolated, uh, it, it took a unilateral action instead of sort of um, talking at the bilateral level if they had any problems at the border. Um, I think uh, it is going to heighten tensions. Uh, it will uh, create a serious problem for both the countries. And I think it will give an opportunity to those who are trying to exploit both the smugglers as well as, um, you know, the other countries who are not interested in good relations with uh, Iran, that Pakistan should have with Iran and further isolate Iran. Uh, I think they will be the beneficiaries. And uh, I think uh, trade activity and other activities would also be affected. Well, I think it's not very helpful for Pakistan because um, in many ways it adversely affects uh, Pakistan. Uh, its trade also suffers. Um, the economic conditions in Pakistan also suffer because, you know, the best trade opportunities, economic development is greatly can be enhanced uh, if your relations with your neighbors are good. And uh, there is also a danger of uh, other adverse activities taking place uh, and those uh, smugglers and also those uh, who want um, uh, militant organizations and all, they benefit from all this because they take this opportunity and sort of uh, develop sanctuaries in countries which are hostile to you. And uh, the hostile countries then, uh, uh, you know, India and uh, and now, uh, as you rightly mentioned, Afghanistan uh, and uh, if Iran also becomes a hostile country, there, there will be serious consequences. I think uh, Pakistan realizes that and uh, that is why uh, it uh, has always been wanting to have good relations with Iran. But uh, I think the situation uh, got worse because the Iranians uh, uh, I think lost their patience because of certain activities which were taking place on the border. But I think uh, that th there should have been greater wisdom and uh, foresight uh, for Iran because Iran is far more isolated than you know many countries would even imagine. Uh, because the best, both uh, America, Britain, and to an extent the European Union uh, are. Uh, uh, you know, uh, not engaging with Iran, it has been isolated and um, there is not much activity between these countries. It's only China and Russia to some extent have been helpful towards Iran. And if it also uh, develops hostile relations with countries like Pakistan, uh, who are well-wishers and have a large community which go for also religious activities to Iran and vice versa come to Pakistan, I think um, th this is a very tragic and also should be a source of great worry to both the country's leadership.